Hi, my name is Megan Reisner. I'm our Employment Services Director at CTA Community Supports. Here at CTA, we provide a variety of services, employment services, day program, after school service. Um, I've been working here at CTA for about two years or so um, and been in this field altogether for a little over five years. Supporting someone with more significant dis disabilities um, customizes absolutely the way to go. Um, as far as um, support and employment, where you, you get a little piece of information of what this individual may like, but with customized employment, um, with someone with most significant disabilities, you really get to um, discover and pull little pieces um, that they, where they shine. I believe that everybody in my company believes that everybody is employable. Um, we just have to find what that is and with customized employment, um, the discovery process allows us to find what those are. So there is one story that I'd like to share about a young man we supported through this School to Work project. Um, his name is Andrew. Uh, we worked with him, I think he had two years of school left when we first started working with him. Uh, both family and the school both stated that at, you know he was unemployable, he couldn't stay on task for more than five minutes. In the past, he's had really uh, aggressive behaviors, things like that. Um, but when we first started working with Andrew, um, after the home visit, we learned some really interesting things that he loves to work with his hands and he loves working with his tools. He liked to take um, door hinges off with a screwdriver. And I was like, oh, that's awesome. We're gonna try that. So we did a ton of activities where he worked with his hands and working with tools. And we found that was a huge passion for him. When we heard that he could only stay on task for maybe five, 10 minutes at a time, we were seeing that he was fully engaged and happy for like a half hour or more when he was working with tools. It was amazing. So we found a company um, that, it's a mattress company and they recycle mattresses, and they gave Andrew an internship opportunity. And he did amazing. The employer kept coming back to us saying, he works faster and harder than most of my employees. So after the internship ended, he hired Andrew on. So now this young man is working, he's working three days a week now, an hour each shift. Um, he has, this is his last year in school, but um, this in the next few weeks, he's gonna be transitioning out of his school um, and increasing his hours. So he works Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, He'll be working from 11 to 2, and he won't be going to school those days, um, which is amazing. And then he'll go to school those other two days. It's just a great process and transition to get him ready for what it's going to be like when he does graduate post high school. Participating in this project has definitely changed the way that we provide services. Um, this project has shown collaboration is key. So we participate with VR and the uh, Department of Workforce Services. Um, and we built those relationships with those folks in the project. So now that when we, outside of the project, we work with individuals, we're still using those resources and using a team approach, which is so important. Um, beforehand, we would just kind of do our own thing, customize, and we would just do, our employment specialists would go out and do their own thing. But we found that through this project, the collaboration really improves the outcome of the people that we support.